Hi, if you want to make a Tikinter app to watch uh, videos, we can do a very simple, simple app like this. Let me let me create a new Tikinter file, uh, a new Python file into my where I store my videos here in FFmpeg output. I have this video here of my tutorials made lately and let's make one called um, video video player it will be very simple and so let's first of all I'm gonna import the Kinter SDK That is the model for a graphic user interface. Then I'm going to create a a window with root equal to k dot k, and then at the end of my code, I'll put the main loop to make the window active. And then I'm gonna uh, what can I do? Very simply, I'll do a list box. Vtk dot list box that has as first argument this root this window here and then as mm, and nothing more then I just pack it to make it visible let's see if we got some errors there it is the window now into the list box. I'm going to put all the videos that I got into the uh, the folder where I have this Tkinter, this Python file. So I wanted to import OS and also let's import Glob. I want to use Glob to see what files are into the, the folder. And so for let me do a for loop like this F for F, this is a comprehension comprehension list and it's a sort of for loop um, in just one line so for F for F in uh, in glob dot glob asterisk mp4 so this will make a list of all the well, we can also do like this um, mp4 equal. Okay, so in mp4, let me print it. We will have the list of all the mp4 file. mp4, yeah, the video file. Here it is. The files you can see here on the right, uh, on the right side of the screen. My my mp4 file that are made on my tutorial. So I wanted to now put these files into this list box. So I'm gonna do listbox.insert um, from the end, so from the start 1.0 to what I'm gonna insert is If I do so, I will get nothing because I need to put the MIMP4. I don't know if I can do this. I just trying, but I don't think. So I'm just gonna do a for loop in which I'm gonna do put a movie in the list box for movie and MP4 list box dot insert and. Let me use TK and and there it is our list of files. Now I want to make I want to start them when I click on them. When I double click on them. To do it to do so I have to do listbox.bind 
use the bin method and write here double button like this and then start video video start video and that's pretty everything I just need to create my function start video and I will simply simply uh, pass here the okay I wanted to the selected video that I wanna that is list box um, list box dot and how do they call the uh, core selection okay core selection so get well let's do in do it in two steps so this will give me the the index of the of the selection let me write it good right selection and then I will have cell equal list box dot get the index so in this is the this is the movie name movie name will be this the one that I selected and and then I will start it with the start file simply with this movie movie name so I will not open it into into my window but I will make um, the movies to start with the operating system uh, default uh, video player at least it should work double button okay I must put a D here bind this is the method to make something happen when you double click on uh, on the list box okay there it is let me start this one and what is the error here take zero position one was given okay let me put here event it should work let me start this and okay this is this is my this is my video you see it started and so that is how you can use a little guy application graphic user interface application with the Kinter to start a video someone asked me this I don't know if, if exactly this that he was thinking about but this is a simple way to make you see how you can use the Kinter there are many videos on on my uh, YouTube channel and also on my blog that is pythonprogramming.altervista.org and if you like this video and you want to see more like this you can ask me to do some videos in the comments and you can also subscribe to encourage me to do other videos like this. Thank you.